Right now, thousands are without power in the Waco area because of last night's storm. Those storms also caused some serious damage. Fox 44's Earl Stoudemire shows us what happened to one local church that took a big hit. Adam M. G. Waco First Assembly of God has been at this location for nearly 60 years. Its pastor says he got a call early this morning saying the roof flew off the building. The five o'clock call from the fire department's a little startling. You know, you never want that call. Waco First Assembly of God Pastor John Palmer says they just installed the new roof two years ago. Palmer adds how the storm also caused a natural gas leak. They ran a scan of the building. There's no gas leak inside. It was just a pipe outside, so we called uh, Atmos. Atmos came and sealed off the gas, so now we're safe. Palmer says it's been over 15 years since the building was last damaged. There's little water damage inside the church, and he's happy everything is getting patched up. Everybody has been so helpful from the fire department to Atmos Gas to Belfort Restoration to the local roofing company. It's, it's just been really nice how fast people have responded. Palmer is still unsure how much it'll cost for repairs or how long it'll take. The one thing he is sure of is the church staying open. If, if you need prayer, you can contact us for prayer anytime. Waco First Assembly of God is still trying to decide where Sunday service will take place. They may have it inside their gym or at a nearby church. In Waco, Earl Sotomayor, Fox 44 News.